Fantasy XV is a big game with a big vision and the designers and artists needed an engine that could live up to that. The biggest challenge on the graphics side is that everything is dynamic. So you could say, okay guys, we're going next gen, let's put in a physically based lighting system and global illumination and all that. But then you say, oh, and by the way, thick clouds can roll in at any time. Or you could be indoors one minute and the next minute you're not anymore because some big monster came and ripped the roof off the building. That's the kind of game we're dealing with here. The character's uh, skin needs to look like it's not just a surface, but that light goes into the skin, bounces around and comes back out. That the car paint shader looked like real car paint with layers, a uh, base coat, metal flake and top coat on top of it. Final Fantasy XV is a fantasy based on reality, so um, the art designers have created incredibly high detailed models that we've never had before and the shaders need to step it up to match. Um, so we needed to go with uh, physically based shaders. シェーダーが物理ベースになることで当然ライト側も現実と同じようになるべきです。我々は照明一つ一つを計測し、それを数値に落とし込んでいます。輝度や照射範囲を確定したライトアセットがあれば、街の照明配置が正しくデザインできます